Happen in funerals. People are upset. They're emotional, and, and I know how you feel about Asa. That kiss was not about Asa. It was about you, Blair. Honey, how can you say that you don't deserve to be here? Because it's true. But I've been here for weeks, and I never come to see Asa. Not even once. And when I finally decided to, it was too late. <sighs> I want you to know I forgive you. For what? For not telling me about Asa. I know you didn't do it on purpose. You were just grief stricken. We all are. Grandma? Who is this? I used to be your grandmother. Where's Bo now? Last I saw him, he was heading out for a walk with a bottle of bourbon. We should go find him. Could we after him? I'm going to have to let Max said that he was really concerned about Bo's state of mind. No offense, Lindsay, but Bo's state of mind right now is none of your concern. He's destroyed Carl's favorite old hat. Gonna do anything for anybody. Bo, what is the matter with you? Why are you so angry at Paul? I want to help. 
This situation is under control, Lizzie. You can go. I'd feel better if I could stay until I know he's all right. Oh, I'd feel better if you would go. The last time I looked, this isn't your house. Bo's not your husband or even your boyfriend. I live here, and Bo's the father of my child. And to be perfectly honest, Lindsay, you have a way of turning everything into the Lindsay show, and that's not what Bo needs right now. I would never do anything to upset him. You wouldn't need to, but you know, Lindsay Rappaport, it just goes with the territory. Now you excuse me. You have no authority. I'm here because Rex asked me to be and because Bo is my friend. Bo is your friend? Every bit as much as he is yours. Bo and I are friends and that's... Are that two still fighting over Bo? I guess some things never change. I'm the one who killed him. 